the boy. What's up, fellas? Jack West, one of the only dudes I actually mess with in the industry because Still I want to like boost his ego too much, but he's <laughs> like authentic and whatnot. You got a show coming up? I got a show coming up in like three and a half months. I feel like I'm in a pretty good spot. So he's ready right now to step on stage, so. Nah, no, nah. I'm not ready. <laughs> no, I, will be, I will be though in like three months. Do a little pin mid, mid, uh, mid set. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try, you're going to be one of the first people to hear it, I'm going to come off of everything, like TRT and just everything see, completely? yeah, TRT and everything, just see what I can get my levels back to, That's if it's possible, because I've been on TRT for I think like two or three years now. I'm going to feel like shit, but we'll see. I want to get big, you know what I'm saying, but not too big. I personally don't want to be walking around at 260, like, you know, I don't want to chase going that heavy, <laughs> like, that doesn't sound fun to me. Hey, when he steps on stage, game changer. Have you uh, changed up your training at all, like for prep? Um, well, kind like of, more hypertrophy or like yeah. higher rep and all that, breaking down the muscle. Yeah, it's like a lot of volume kind of stuff. But it's funny, it's like my coach Kyle, which obviously he knows what he's doing, tells me to do one thing, and then you know Jared, Jared mm -hmm. Feathers. Yeah. I'll go work out with Jared, and he's like, no, like I would not train like that. You know, but yeah. that's like bodybuilding in general. Like everyone yeah, yeah. has their different methods. Has their way. Like, that elevation, I think it was yesterday or the day before, some dude, like, jacked-ass bodybuilder, like, just totally blew out his knee. But you just hear, like, a loud snap. That, like, makes And they, like, collapse. And then he got up, dude, and his quad was just, like, hanging over his knee. Look at, look at this dude's stretch marks. That's how you know he's making gains. I had On both sides. Like, like a dude. damn tiger over here. <laughs> I don't even really notice him, honestly. Yeah. Do you ever do blood work? Or have you done blood work recently? The last time I did it was, like, three months ago. I want to get it again halfway through my prep when I'm on cycle and then obviously when I'm off. How was it looking? Clean. Yeah? Oh, that's good, yeah. That's one thing I always recommend too for you guys watching. Definitely like before you ever touch a cycle, I mean even if you're going to be natty forever, you should still do blood work to see how you are doing internally. Because anything on the external you can see but you don't know how your kidney function is, your liver enzymes, thyroid, testosterone, estrogen, like all the stuff, you the stuff that you actually mirror. care about. Yeah, they can't see Obviously, I'm going to be doing blood work with like coming off TRT and all that just to see what I can get my levels back to. But it'll be through Let's Get Checked. You guys can use discounts. I believe it's KO Kenny will save you like 30%, but I'll put that in the description down below. You still have so much time too, bro. You're going to get, you're going to be lean by the end of it. That's the goal, man. It's like, I don't want to rush this prep. Because my cardio is so chill, bro. It's me, 3.2 on the treadmill, 30 minutes in the morning. Sometimes I'll do more at night. I just want to maintain as much muscle as I can. Right. I'm excited for it. Especially with your size you have, dude. You're going to look like a freak. You're going to dwarf Jay Cutler when he comes in here, bro. I'm about to fly away, <laughs> dude. Wingspan of a bald eagle or something. I just got my knuckles done. Oh, that came out clean, dude. I didn't see that. I know. Hell yeah. Since they're not noticeable, I was tweaking when I got them done, but that's like you can't even hardly notice them. Especially, gotta, especially as they lighten up too. I gotta It'll be. Touched up, really. That's clean though. I like that. Hell yeah. That's probably my favorite Star Wars character. For sure. Did you ever watch the Clone Wars cartoons? I need to, no, because it, it, I've, I've heard it's lit. Everyone, like, dude, that's like one of my favorite cartoons ever. I actually need because, to. Because uh, you get to see his brother uh -huh. and all that, and they actually go really hard. I'm like nerding out about it. Dude, this National Donut Day. And the Mochi Donuts, bro. They were doing this promotion where first three people in line at this new Mochi Donut shop today got three Mochi Donuts for a fucking year. Bro, a year. Cat was like, I'm about to go camp out. Oh, no. <laughs> Cause then I'm gonna fuck up my prep. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, all right, I'm not competing anymore. I'm just donut eating. 
new YouTube channel. We'll go to like the farmer's market, because I'll go there and get eggs and shit. And she's getting like s'mores, brownies, and I'm about to kick her out. <laughs> so I want to do my show in like October, maybe September. And then it'll give me like two months to rebound well. Yeah. But then during the winter time, I'm going up to Washington and I'm fucking eating whatever the fuck I want, bro. Not bad. Dirty bolt. I mean, for the people that been to Vegas, like, you would know how good the food is. And it's all 24-7, so you could go at like three, like, for instance, Pink Box down the street, like, bomb donuts. They're open 24-7. You guys stop this Pink Box. Dude, I need a sponsorship. <laughs> I need a sponsorship. But they're open 24-7. It's like, 3 a.m., you're like, yo, I, I want a bomb donut. You can just go get a fucking donut. Pink Box is like the dirty side chick that you like, you don't bring home to your mom. It's like mid. And then St. Honors is the donuts you wipe up. <laughs> <laughs> Problem with being too tall, bro. You hear that? No range of motion. <laughs> Machines cap out before you can get like full extension. So I guess ultimately the question I wanted to ask is, you're natty, right? All natty, baby. Born and Life, raised. Lifetime natty, you know. Lifetime, not, never considered hopping on anything, man. Never even close. Don't want to be a sellout, you know. What yeah, I'm you know. <laughs> Just had to throw the nod in there, just in case some people take it serious. No, people would. Like, it. Yeah, people clip it. Jack West claims he's natural. Bro, I've come to the conclusion that there's no winning. You know, there's natties out there that I believe are natty, and people will still be like, oh, they're on here, fuck that kid, he's a liar. Like, people are gonna say whatever they want at the end of the day, so like, yeah. just do what you want to do. Truth. I, I mean, wanna, the I thing, the thing I'm at right now is it's just like, why would I be taking any, even like TRT, it's like if you don't need it and you're not competing, there's no like, I mean, I'm just like business mindset, yeah, like, yeah. like there's no real goal for Unless me you like really to be using enjoy anything. Being on it, yeah, think. right. We'll see how it goes, fuck, I don't know. I'm, I'm interested to see how it goes for him too. Maybe if my sex drive like plummets for a couple weeks though, it's just like, just that'll, right that'll be enough on. to convince me to get right back on. I'll be like, ah, fuck it, ain't worth it.